Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Adventure Craft, episode three for our series. We're leaving right where we left off last time, and that is we got a house up, or a little hut here, anyways. We've got a workbench and a bed. It is nighttime now. We'll go ahead and, well, you know, we don't have to sleep because we can mess with crafting a little bit while it's nighttime, right? Oh, we do need food, though. We're hurting on food pretty badly. Ah, oh, we've got some blueberries. We can eat those up. That helped a lot because it was a blueberry handful. Might have had those for a while. I don't know. Can we eat wheat by any chance? Okay, we can. It's not very good, but it's better than nothing. We'll go around and collect some more stuff later. Just glad to have it out of the inventory anyways for now till we can make some different stuff, which you can see that we can, we can make here. We're missing a lot, though. Okay, a forge is next. We need one more charcoal, some stone slab. Stone slab is what we were kind of wondering what to make. Yeah, two out of three stones. So we need stones to do that. We already have, okay, an acorn grenade would be useful if we got gunpowder. We've already got a sword. I see we've got a throwable rock, kind of interesting. Okay, we can go to the sleep for, I don't know, maybe like two hours there. Okay, let's get some stuff done. Also, somehow... Okay, somehow I lost my pickaxe. I'm not really sure what happened to it. So, Oak Club it is. And I wouldn't mind crafting a second one. So I still have my Oak Axe. I do. It needs to be repaired. But oak pickaxe is what I'm going for here. Oh, also. And then where's my sword? I had a sword. I'm a little confused. Is it in the workbench still? I know I made an oak sword. I don't know why it's disappearing. Now I'm missing twine. So I had an oak sword, but I like lost it. Okay, stone hammer. We've got this guy here. We could shop again. Oak arrows. Ooh. Well, we've got plenty of backpack space as far as I could tell. That could be useful. Well, I just figured it could be useful if we could get some honey out of it. Okay, he doesn't seem to be getting attacked by the bees as much as I figured he would be. Oh, maybe they don't attack anymore? Oh, yep, they do. Okay, but if we go around this guy, he'll deal with them generally. There. Maybe we can run up real quick and grab some of the honeycomb, which is always useful. Oh, okay. Okay, we'll eat one of these apples. That'll help a lot. Alright, I guess we'll just head back. Somehow I lost my pickaxe again. Oh, I have it. Okay. I lost the axe, though. We can get that back. Just go here. Oh, that's the repair. I don't like fumbling through the screen. I feel like... It could be a little bit better. Okay. Twine was something we needed. So that we could get some better stuff. Where's my dog? Come help me, dog. That I'll just go over to this food shop, which is perfect. I'll gladly spend my hard-earned cash on that. Also, we should be able to use this on these corpses here. Or not. Okay, what can we buy? Blueberry handful. A lot of this is expensive. We'll take the five blueberry handfuls. It costs a lot of gold, but gold is definitely not the end of the world. Let's have this guy shoot this 
goblin off me real quick. Maybe not. There we go. That's what I wanted. Ooh, we got two blueberry handfuls right there. We just paid a ton for them. Oh, well. Oh, what can you do? There we go. That's what we needed. Stone pickaxe. Nice. Eventually, we'll find the stone axe if we haven't already. I haven't checked to see if we have. Go around and collect these blueberries while we're in the area, especially if we can knock down multiple trees at a time, which is a good tactic, by the way. If you get, like, a lot of trees lined up, you can knock them all down at once. And it does help. Stone axe. Okay, not where I expected to find it, but I'll take it. Like, if I set up perfectly here, I should be able to hit these both, and I can. Oh, we gotta move. Yep, we gotta move right now. We're gonna lose our dog. That's okay. He'll find us again. Oh, boy. That guy died quick. Oh, boy. Where's our house? Oh, wait. Here's a good chance right now for us to get a lot more gold. Or die, I guess. Well, at least now we can find out if we spawn inside the house or not. We don't. That's good to know. That is good to know. Also, our dog spawns next to us regardless of where he died. So that's also good to know. So don't die far away. That's pretty much the moral of the story. I think we do lose all of our gold. At least we definitely don't have as much as we had. So if I can collect all that gold those guys drop without dying and run away real quick, that's the best way to do it. So we'll probably try that next time. Uh, with that being said, we need more twine, and I don't know how to get it. What does kindling get me? Get more sawdust. Well, either way, we've got the stone. So let's get... Throwable rock is not what I was trying to get. There, stone slab. Now that's what I wanted. Oh, if we just hover over it, we can see what we get? Well, that's a lot easier than just crafting it. All right. What's this say? Mysterious light blue gemstone. If you look closely, you can see a tiny skull inside watching you. Kind of cool. Okay, we've got some scrap wood. We don't need it right now. What we need is to build ourselves. Oh, look at all this. Stone hammer, stone pickaxe. Great. We can do a stone axe right now. That would be nice, and we do have everything we need except for a stone wedge. What do we need to get that? I couldn't even begin to tell you. Uh, I'd imagine a stone slab is one of the recipes, and we don't know what we get from the other one. Ah, stone wedge. Good guess. That was a good guess. So with that being said, oh, we can craft a bee nade, which is kind of cool. What else are we missing? Okay, and then one stone slab. We need more stone either way. Let's go out and grab some more stone. That's a given. There we go. That's a lot better, and I saw a lot of stone there too pop up. Food-wise, we're doing okay. Eat those handfuls of blueberries. All right, stone axe it is. We just need some stone slabs. We'll just go ahead and take this stone, craft a few of those. Go right here, and the last thing we need is the actual oak axe. Which we can get real quick. We need an oak sword as well. So we're going to need some clubs. Let's just craft a bunch of them. Like that. That's a lot better. Okay, an oak axe. I would also like to craft a stone axe. Thank you. And a sword if I can. Okay, I can't get it because the twine. Fine. Oh, I've got the sword. What the heck? Oak sword. So where's my pickaxe? 
Oh, pickaxe is in here. Okay, nighttime will be coming soon. We'll try our tactic this time to get gold, but let's try this stone and see how it does. Pretty good. We get about a log every time we hit it. Even a few, actually. It doesn't so much like getting better equipment doesn't necessarily mean you like go faster. Like you do go a little bit faster, but the main thing is that you just get more bang for your buck, I guess. Like we're getting a lot of blueberry handfuls now instead of just getting regular blueberries, so that's pretty important. Our food shouldn't be an issue now if we can continue to find blueberries, but we're going to have to drift farther and farther out to do that. We need a gold key. Okay, let's head back real quick. And if we see some of those knights, we might hang out around them so we can get some gold. Okay, we see him, but he's not going to be enough. It'd have to be the knights, and I don't see him around. Oh, look at all the blueprints, though. We're going for it. Wow, that's a lot of blueprints. Can I do it? If I do the apples, I can. There we go. I don't know if that was all blueprints. But we can collect some gold real quick. Okay, we're uh, we're not immortal anymore. Let's get out of here. Oh, wait. We've got that guy now, though. Oh, he's not helping, though. Okay, wait. Wait till he kills. Okay. Okay. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, they'll actually follow me around. Well, that's nice. Don't mind me, guys. You go do your thing. I'm just going to harvest. What's the crown give me? Plus 100 gold. Holy crap. Wow, that's nice. Well, you could really use that to your advantage. Okay, we're heading back now. Okay, so if we look... We got a lot of gold from that run. That was a good run. I don't think we got anything else that was like crazy useful, but I think we did get a bunch more recipes. I saw them popping up here and there. I think the yeah, uh, the gold ones actually mean that you already have them, unfortunately. Uh, so blueberry handfuls, let's just go ahead and craft that. And we'll craft some honeycomb. We did get some revive potions, kind of a big deal. And food isn't going to be an issue for a little bit now. We even got a health uh, bulb. Cool. And yeah, the revive potion, which I would technically doesn't help me, really, if I could be perfectly honest. It only helps if I have, like, allies, but we'll keep the health potion down there. Okay, more stone is something I need. We also got to figure out what else we're going to craft here. Okay, let's... Go cut down more logs, actually, too. And get a lot more apples this way. Nice. Tons of logs, tons of apples. So this is the best way to do it. And then eventually, I'm sure you can get better weapons, but... And then once you get fully established and you're just repairing items too, it's a lot better that way. You're not constantly like crafting the same items. Think Scruffy there, Anara, I guess. She's stuck on a tree. Lots of blueberry handfuls. Yeah, food is not going to be an issue anymore. Which makes me happy. We can go ahead and take down some of these goblin villages once we're feeling it. I think we're going to do that soon enough. We can help this guy out real quick. I would have to technically pull my sword out. Oh, he got him. Oh, he dropped uh, goblin scrap. There we go. So we can destroy some of these goblin tents. They spawn the goblins around the area. and Not that the goblins are a huge threat, but they can cause... Ooh, a health bulb. Nice. They can cause uh, somewhat of a headache here and there. If allowed to run rampant for too long. Let's continue to get some apples. 
keeps health nice and high uh, because it keeps food up. All right. Lots of dead bees here. Can I do anything with that? I can. Harvest honeycomb from it. Okay, let the dog be stupid. I'm fine with that. We're going to run off. Okay, I think this is kind of considered like leaving the starting area. Which we can do. We're just not going to do it yet. Now, if I wanted to take this down, I probably could. Yeah, you can see, like, this is kind of like leaving. It's like a maze almost. And once you're sort of skilled enough to navigate it, you can pretty much leave, like, your little starting zone. But it's good to kind of harvest all the resources and build lots of, uh... Well, just get really situated and build lots of stuff. Ooh. We should be able to repair. Stone sword, I want... Stone pickaxe repair. No, I want stone axe repair. Okay, I need extra scrap stone. Which, that's easy. I just need to break down some stone. Okay, just let the dog be stupid. It's kind of fitting anyways. Oh, I can give them commands. I didn't even know that. We'll, we'll keep that in mind for when they're healed up. Okay, where's my pickaxe? Here we go. There we go. Some sulfur, which I think might give us gunpowder. If we were to break it down, what do we got new here? Bombs, teleporters. Okay, it must have just been the bomb. What do we got here? Yeah, a couple shields, but I'm nowhere near. I could break the scrap metal down for, but I need iron plates. I'm nowhere near that kind of stuff yet. Basic oak shield. Uh, yeah, if we can craft it. I need a workbench. It's fine. So let's throw the shield on. That's going to help a lot. Okay, but the stone sword is really what I want. I need stone slabs. We've got plenty of stone for stone slabs. Ooh, no we don't. We've only got enough for... Okay. Well, that's fine. Can I at least take... No. Can I br break this down into... I don't really need that throwable rock. Okay, of course not. Okay. Alright, what do we need for a forge then? Let's look at that. Okay, a charcoal, some gravel, some more stone slab. Okay, stone slab is like our number one crutch right now. Let's go ahead and sleep for three hours. We can get charcoal from this. I know that. And we need more stone. We actually need a lot more stone. Let's, let's go out and do that. And we're going to swap the sword out for the stone axe. And can we repair that real quick? No, we can't because we need more stone scrap. We need a stone. And uh, stone pickaxe, too. We need two wedge. Okay, we can't do that just yet. But we're getting some stone there. Gotta find more. And 
we'll always grab food when we can. Ooh, there, see some scrap metal, some twine. Always good to hit those chests if you find them. Trader, we've got the money, so what can we get? Nothing really useful here. Okay, I guess we can't use those commands till they're leveled up. Our dog's got to level up, probably. Okay, lots of scrap metal there. Okay, there's food over here. We don't have our stone axe anymore, though. Her we completely ran through it. So, and then you can't repair it once it's completely damaged, right? So that's kind of crappy. So then you got to build an oak axe and a stone wedge again. Huh, interesting. Okay. Oh, that's not what I want to do. There, that's what I wanted. Okay. All right, stone hammer. Stone axe repair. Okay, I guess it did work. We've got extra clubs. All right. The pickaxe is what we need, and we don't have an oak pickaxe anymore. But we can make one. We need another wedge. Which we can make. Which means we can now make a stone pickaxe. Okay, okay. Okay, let's head back to our house. We may use this as an opportunity to get more gold, I think. How are we doing on logs? We've got over a hundred. Does that just give us another cottage? But what if we want some other stuff? I guess I don't know how to build anything else right now besides the cottage. And all the recipes I'm finding. But we know we got to get the forge. We just need another stone slab. Do I have? We've got two. Okay, we can get this organized a little bit. Sawdust, pretty useless. This stuff. Where's all my wood? Oh, what if I didn't want house block? Okay, what if I didn't want that? I'm kind of upset that that happened. I can't get my 100 logs back, back either. Okay, I guess we'll just leave it in here for now. Oh, it looks like more than I want to deal with out there. But I bet if one of these guys die, they drop a good amount of stuff, right? Maybe not. There's some gold. That's what I wanted. Here we go. Now's our chance. Oh, I don't have the golden apples pulled out, which means we're going to have to dart in here real quick. Oh, boy, more gold. I'm trying not to, like, it's very hard to keep track. Quickly run in, grab some stuff, run out. Oh, boy. Nice. Good grab. 
There's a bunch of others. Oh my goodness, look at all that stuff down there. Oh, where's my... Where's my... Revi... Or my golden apples. Here we go. Okay, we're going for it real quick. Oh, are we going for it? Oh boy. That's what I'm talking about. We even got a golden key. I see it pop... I saw it pop up. Well, that was a nice grab, if I gotta say so myself. We got 3,000 gold. thought it was more than that. I thought I saw 5,000 pop up. Well, whatever. We got a lot there, and we got a golden key, which is a pretty big deal. So we're gonna go open up one of those golden chests. We might as well do it now. Um, and we got stone weapons. All right, so actually, we won't do it right now because we're out of time. I keep losing track of time. It's so easy to do in this game. Okay, so next time what we're going to do is we're going to go find a golden chest, open it up, see what we get. And then we're going to leave this kind of uh, little perimeter here and explore the outside portion of our area and see what we can find. So thank you guys for joining me. Do hope you enjoyed it. And I look forward to seeing you next time.